Hey guys, Mr. Knife Fighter here. I'm gonna show you guys something that uh, I got at a gun show a little while back, and I have loved it so much. This has become my new favorite thrower because you can't miss. You, <laughs> you have to suck really hard to miss the target, and if you hit it anyway, it's going to stick. Doesn't matter if it hits backwards, forwards, slantwise, however you want to call it. And this thing is scary. How is this legal in California? I have no idea. But you know what? I'm happy it is. Because this thing is awesome. This is the Boker Beal Throwing Axe. Hefty. It's got five, I'm sorry, six points that you can stick from. This will stick no matter how you throw it. I've thrown it underhand, I've thrown it sideways, I've thrown it backwards over my head, not recommended. I've thrown this a variety of different ways, and uh, it's a lot of fun. You can't miss. As you saw in the video, this thing sticks deep. The only downside, and I mean the only downside to this throwing weapon, and I wouldn't even consider this recreational, I would consider this a weapon, because you could take somebody the hell out with this thing quietly too not that i you know endorse that or anything um this thing is scary 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 easily thrown i love it love it love it the only thing i don't like about this is when this thing sticks into the target unless it sticks head on by that point it's probably going to hit with one of these convex points and when that sticks into the target you have to somehow work that out. And it's pretty hard, because this thing sticks really, really deep every single time. It sticks probably about like yay deep every time I've thrown it. And you've really got to work your ass off to get this thing out of the target. Um, I've had to hit it with a hammer to get it out, but when you're trying to pull it out of the target, like say if it sticks like that, you kind of have to pull up and like tweak it back and forth a bunch until you can even get it loose. And the hard part is when you're trying to pull it out this way, this curve is just digging deeper into the target. So you have to work it back and forth, back and forth for a good couple minutes before you can get this thing out of the target. Granted, if you were throwing this at, say, a bad guy for like a home defense situation, um, that's what you want. You don't want them to be able to take this out really easily. You want that shock factor of having something like this sticking out of their torso. I can't think of anything scarier. Um, again, not that I condone throwing these at people. Do not ever throw this at somebody. Because it will kill their ass. Don't do it. Don't be stupid, stupid. But buy it. Buy a bunch of them. Throw them in your backyard. Throw them at a target. Throw them at boxes. This thing's awesome. I found this at the gun show. My friend has one. He loves it. And we went camping and we threw the hell out of it. And I said, I need to get one. It's so awesome. So when I went to the gun show and found it, I was like, how much is it? He said, 30 bucks. I said, deal. And I bought it. If I had more money, I would have bought three of them. These things are awesome. I cannot recommend it enough. The Boker Beal Throwing Axe. Get yours today.